there is a severe crisis of judges in this country and most of the cases were not been able to be decided and the government is having a real problem but on the other side almost every day every second people throw judgments almost everybody in this world has become a judge they keep throwing judgments without even trying to understand the other part of the story and because of their judgments many people are affected afflicted and they live a pathetic death because they became untouchables for the society for their family for their friends without being a, even a judgment being passed as per the law the situation in the world in this country has become so bad that because of the judgments of the people and the judgments came from where the judgments came from the borrowed knowledge the judgments came from the gastric problems from the indigestion the judgments came from their sugar their diabetic problems and from the various diseases which they are suppressing using the allopathic method or the medicinal method they have never un tried to understand the body mother teresa said if you judge people then you don't have time to love them. the judgment is the barrier to love them is to just understand or just melt with your people without any barriers the whole fight of the society is to break down the rich and the poor to have an equality in the society whole fight in the world is to break down the black and the white space so that there can be equality the whole fight of this indian continent is to break down the brahmana kshatriya vaishya kshatra for an equality because that is where they know the brahmana kshatriya vaishya kshatra came the caste the black and the white the caste and the hindu the muslim the christian the sikh the jaina the jewish etc they all came judgments to break down the judgments that as long as you have these things in your mind you are carrying a huge big stone inside your head it's too heavy as per the zen master the stone idol is outside is it inside your head or outside it's inside my head tells the disciple then it must be very heavy the judgments which you're throwing is very heavy because when you point one finger to others please try to understand three fingers are pointing back to you can you drop that and if you can drop that one judgment that is the greatest meditation and every one judgment when you drop of your sister and your brother like how you were in the childhood you were like child like to embrace and hug and love your sister and your brother and as you grow up when borrowed knowledge borrowed money comes into your bank and status changes to different definitions then you start judging people even including your own father and mother your own gurus according to the status that status is materialistic and it can just disappear the one thing which doesn't disappear is the love and to have the love you have to understand and understanding was from childhood what has been taught and once you melt with the tree and you start hugging the tree you get resistance power most of the pet animals and other animals doesn't understand your language but when you truly feed them allow them to smell you not you smell them 
feed and allow them to smell you. That is where, that is the first space, the first stage, first step of is allow. Then you can see the melting point. You can slowly touch them, massage them. Yes. And as you massage them, you can remove some of the ticks and other things from the body. Then the animal knows there is a vibration from your body to their body, not their bodies in your mind. Yesterday, my children gave me the remote control of the TV. And I took the remote control and turned it towards my head and I pressed it. Huh? The TV did not sta start. I took the remote, then they said you should turn it towards the TV. I turned it towards the TV and it started. And it started jumping, dancing, varieties. That means this brain, whatever has been put, <laughs> doesn't, it is done. Some of the materialistic world is very important for the people. Mother Teresa said, do not, if you judge people, you have no time to love them. Yes, the judgments. It's a barrier. It stops you from understanding the truth. It stops you from your growth. Your people drop your judgments and you can see every one of your people, especially your relatives. It's a thousand men warrior, more powerful than diamonds, materialistic diamonds and gold. Never ending. It's vast ocean, not a pawn. Once you start judging people, you become a pawn. And in that pond, stagnant water stinks, flowing water is fresh water. In the sea, the washed ocean is flowing. In the pond, it starts stinking. You stopped people coming to you. You stopped loving. You have no time to love your people. Spend time with your people. Catch their hands. Sit together. Chit chat. Work on them. Massage them. I heard in Japan, they massaged even the animals and the cows three times and in all especially the martial arts where i was practicing after every class we massage we massage other friends other friends after massage only we take a hot massage is very important it helps you to understand and love each other the plants also the trees also, the animals also, everything starts growing more powerfully and you can avoid diseases. Mother Teresa said, now she is Saint Teresa. If you judge people, you have no time to love them. Just love. Love can move mountains. In that love, you could understand every part of your wife and your husband. Every once you start uh, penetrating deeper into that love, you become a scuba diver of that love relationship with your children. Every inch of their growth is satori, is enlightenment, is ananta, paramananta. In that you can understand and love the land, the family. If you love the land, you know what is rainwater harvesting, you know what is solar to love, you understand what is the power of the Surya Namaskar, what is the power of the Shastaka Namaskar, what is the power of the Tamasoma Jyotirkamaya, from darkness to light that bullock in the house. From that power of the family tree, if you stop judging the family, only if you love, you can see the joint family. It is washed, huge. It stays there 800 or 1000 years. They're like the Daisugi method of growing the trees. And then the family tree is your God, your truth.